Hello everyone, this is Harshal Desai from Express. Uh, we have Dr. Uh, Manoj Kumar uh, with us, uh, who is Director IC Force. Uh, thank you so much for joining us in 33rd edition of Technology Sabha, sir. Uh, please tell us how has been your experience so far of attending this conference. Okay. Uh, uh, actually, this gave me a lot of information. Um, now I, I heard uh, many talks where uh, people who are really implementing uh, the e-governance, they are talking and we got a, I got a lot of uh, new experience from them. At the same time, we are getting what is happening around from the uh, other people, right. other side of the right. company people. So it is a really great experience for me and I think uh, I wish all this uh, should move forward. Right. Okay. Sir, Kerala is one of the state which is, uh, you know, uh, kind of taking a lead when it comes to adopt open source yes. uh, solutions and software. Yes. So please uh, share your views on this briefly and also how IC Force is driving this entire mission. Okay. About <clears throat> open source, Kerala, we are, uh, as a government policy, we are supporting open source software, uh, not only software, the hardware also. Uh, the IC Force is a unique government of India organization, government of Kerala organization, where we develop a lot of solutions based on open source. So we have uh, mainly <coughs> e-governance uh, using uh, this uh, open source. We have uh, uh, open uh, IoT devices, that is open hardware systems we are developing with uh, the uh, solutions. Then further we have assistive technology. Apart from whatever the open source, we also take up social challenges right? like we are uh, giving solutions for uh, say people with disabilities like right. blind, etc. That also we are doing. Right. So IC Force is uh, that way it's a unique organization. You cannot see such an organization anywhere in the world. Right. Right. How has been the uh, support from government uh, towards uh, probably the initiatives that IC Force is undertaking? Yeah, uh, we are supporting government specifically in e-governance. We have a local language hmm. computing, uh, specifically Malayalam computing. Set. Right. There uh, we support government uh, uh, with uh, how to, now in Kerala uh, we are going ahead with the Malayalam uh, as a uh, uh, language right. uh, for uh, our all e-governance. Okay. We are uh, supporting with our expertise. Okay. Then uh, uh, about uh, recently uh, we have implemented uh, around 14 different, uh, uh, we have selected 14 different districts in Kerala okay. and implemented automatic weather stations so okay. that we can micromanage weather across Kerala. Right. Like that we are doing in every sector we are giving our uh, presence. All right. Thank you so much uh, Dr. T.K. Manoj Kumar from ICFOS. Thank, Thank you, you so much for joining us sir. Thank you.